Yo, 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 and welcome to another edition of Little Bro Vapes. So what can I say? Thank you very much to all my new subscribers and the old ones. Well, what's Little Bro been vaping on today? It's another hardware review, and it's another starter kit, and it's from Joytech. It's the Ego, A-I-O, Eco. Not very easy to say that. It's got some Eco technology to do with the battery, which we'll talk about. It's also built for high nicotine and nick salts. Um... And it's also got flashing lights. I don't know whether I'm into the flashing lights, but we'll talk about them a bit. So what we'll do is we'll do the unboxing. We'll do I'll look around the pen itself, and then we'll do the pros and cons of bits that we've missed. Straight on to the unboxing. As you can see, it says uh, Ego AIO Eco, and then you've got the mod itself. It does say at the bottom Keep Calm and Vape On. That does go around one of the uh, O-rings as well, but I'll show you that. At the top, it does tell you that it's a sample that it has been sent for review. Then on this side, it does tell you that it's Ego, A-I-O, Eco. I'm getting better at saying this. And then on the other side, it says Joytech with your scratch and sniff. Yeah, authenticity. You've got your um, logo on that side, and it also says www.joytech.com. Then on the back, it tells you that it's the Ego, A-I-O, Eco. It's optimised for high nicotine. It tells you that it's powered by Eco technology. Keep out of the reach of children. And then it lists what you get in the box. You get, obviously, your pen. You get a 0.5 ohm coil. You also get a USB cable, a quick start, a manual, and spare parts. And then at the bo it, bottom, it does tell you that it is grey and all the stuff for um, Joytech itself. So let's have a little look in the box. As you can see, that is where your pen is. Good looking thing. Take that out. Have a look what we get inside. You get your warranty card. You also get your... Um, it tells you all about the coils, the different VG and PG levels and how it works. Um, you also get your user manual. Make sure you read that. It tells you all about how to charge it, pram your um, uh, tank itself as well. So make sure you do read that. You get some spare O-rings. You also get... A USB charging cable and your spare coil, which is a 0.5 ohm coil, like I've told you. So, the pen itself. It's a good looking thing. I really do like it. I like the look of it. And it comes in uh, five different colours. Um, I think if you look over my shoulder this side, it, there should be all the colours, which are grey like this. you got a green, a blue, a black and a red one. So if you have a little look at the top, um, you've got your mouthpiece, it, it's not no changeable, it's just fixed, you can't change it. But what you can do is you can buy another mouthpiece which has got bigger um, airflow on it. So if you just have a little look at the airflow, it's the same on either side, two little holes there. And like I said, you can buy that from the Joytech website and it's a little bit bigger holes for a bit bigger uh, airflow. Then if once you get into your tank, you can see it's very easy filling. At the top, you just fill down the sides. Don't obviously go over the top of it, um, of where your coil is. And then that just fits on the top. Now, to change your coil or to fit your coil, just take your glass off. You'll see that your, your coil actually fits there. You screw that in, put your glass back on, and screw your top on. That's how easy it is. Now, if you actually have a little look at your coil, let's take the spare one out. You'll be able to see at the top, you've got um, four little holes. Now that's your airflow. So what it's basically doing is going down the actual cylinder because your actual coil is only probably about that big. So the airflow is going down the cylinder and then up the chimney and that's how your airflow works. Now the pen itself, this is where the Eco technology comes in. It's a 650 mAh battery. Now what they do is they keep it at low voltage and low wattage which then nearly doubles the battery life so you're getting something like a 1300 mAh battery out of it, out of a 16, uh, sorry, a 650 mAh battery. Now it's very simple, it's five clicks on, one, two, three, four, five, and then it's on, one, two, three, four, five, and then we're off and it double flashes. Now you should be able to just see these colours, wait there we're on, one, two, three, four, five. I'll turn off. There we go. Always works on, on uh, when you're doing a review. So what you do is now it's off, you hold it, and you'll see that colours come up. Well, it should do. There we go. There we go. The purples come up. So then if you just press it, it goes to green. There you go. And you can also have it where it's off. So you don't have to have it on at all. You can turn it off. It's a little bit of a gimmick. And as I said, if you just look around there, it says, oh no, I'll just put 
that into a bit of a uh, bit of focus so you can see it Six seconds. there we go keep calm and vape on <laughs> something a bit different it's a gimmick, isn't it? That's what it is. Um, you've got your charging, your one-amp charging on that side. And then at the bottom, it does give you kite marks and don't vape in the bin. So that is basically your um, mod and tank itself. So, so what we'll do is we'll do the pros and cons and the bits we miss. Because you know I always miss something. See you in a minute. So the pros, the cons, and the bits that we've missed of the Ego, A-I-O, Eco. It's not very easy to say. Now the tank itself is a 1.2 mil tank. Now, the battery is a 650 mAh battery, but with the eco technology that they've got, it doubles up the battery. And what they're saying is you get 350 puffs to a fully charged battery. Now, what they're saying also is that you get with the 1.2 mil tank, you're getting 150 puffs to the actual tank itself. So you roughly get into each charge of the battery, two tanks worth and a little bit. Now, I've been using this a lot. It's really, really good. Um, it's, it's lasted me well over a day, well over a day with the battery. Now, I've gone, the only high nicotine that I had was some vam Vampire Vapes uh, Palmer Violets, which is an 18. Has knocked my head off a bit. So I have used it with the, and that's what's in there now, with the high nicotine, corking flavour and decent clouds. Not bad at all. Really good flavour, like I said, and corking clouds. I've also used it with a three milligram uh, nick, and the flavour's still there. So you can use it with with lower nick as well. I've had no problem with it at all. Um, so the pros and the cons. I can't find any cons on it. I think if if you look at the, um, I've got the C flat uh, from Vaptio. Look at the sort of size difference to it. it. Just fits in your pocket, nice and easy. Very simple to fill, um, especially for the high nicotine. And also, I've never tried the Nick Salt, so I'm going to try and get some Nick Salts for this to, to try on it. Um, so you've got a, a lot of options with it on a 0.5 coil. Now, the coil itself, obviously, you've got the, the coil about that big, and then you've got a chimney extender on it. And then the airflow goes down the sides and up through the, through the chimney. So it's got decent airflow to it. Decent battery, decent flavour. There's not much more I can actually say about it as a starter kit goes. Now, I'm not quite sure on the prices yet. Um, I've had a little look, but it's not quite been released yet in the UK. But I'm surmising it's going to be around about the £20 mark or maybe a little bit less. So for a pen like that, and it's lasting you for a day, decent flavour, decent clouds. It's a big thumbs up from little bro. And, and I've got to say something. Joytech are coming out with some corking starter kits. I've had a number of them to review. And they are really, really good. It's the quality that you get as well. As you know from Joytech, it's always going to be built well. And that's what it is. Um, all right. The, um, the flashing lights. I'm not overly bothered about the flashing lights myself. But some people are into them sort of gimmicks. Also with it, it says keep calm and vape on. Again, it's a little bit of a gimmick. So all in all, let's just wrap this up. All in all, the pros outweigh the cons because there isn't any cons. I can't find anything that I could say to you that is really bad. You're getting decent clouds. You're getting decent flavour, really good flavour. And you're getting good battery life with the new Eco technology. So it's a big thumbs up from little bro. You can see all the details for Joytech and the Ego I A I O Eco down in the descriptions. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. If you like the video, make sure you like, subscribe, and share. The subscribe button's just in the corner. Give a little press and get me that new magic number. And there's one last thing to say, people: keep them juices flowing. <laughs>